Hey everyone, how are you guys doing? Welcome to my masculine channel, a woman manual. It's your girl, Twin D. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, and subscribing. And trust me, I really do appreciate your support. Thanks to Almighty God for bringing everyone here this morning alive and well so we can view our messages under his protection. So now let's see what's going on. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Okay, let's jump in. We have you masculines here. And we're going to see what's happening with the divine feminine. With you, divine masculine, my apologies. What's coming to you in the near future? What's surrounding you? And what's coming towards you? One, one, one on the timer. The divine feminine's reading was so beautiful. I was going to post it, but I, I, I'm definitely going to premiere it. And if, let's see what's going on with your message. Let's see, guys. I just want to jump in. Let's see what's going on. First card on the bottom here is the wine. Happy times, successful times. Successful ventures. see what's going on the anchor what did I say it's successful ventures what did I say it's right here successful ventures so whatever it is that you set your mind to do divine masculine it's gonna be successful you want to move towards the divine feminine it's gonna be successful you want to buy a house? It's going to be successful. You want to buy a car? It's going to be successful. You're moving to that new apartment? That transaction is going to be successful. Everything is working out. And the next card is the lion. See this? There's a sudden shock. Just like the feminines. They got some disappointments too. There's going to be some bad news that's coming in here. But all that is going to pass. Because of what's next. The sun. Happiness and popularity. So all those broken hearts, all those negative emotions, everything is going to switch around. It's time for happiness. And we did start off with that happiness. We did start off with the wine card, successful ventures, happy times, celebration. And then we have successful venture coming out. Your thoughts, just like the Divine Feminine, your thoughts with this lion. That is maybe the thing that's going to try to hold you back from those successful ventures. Because you're reflecting. You're scared to move forward. You're scared to do what it is that you want to do, whether to move Relocate, buy that house, buy that car. Move towards your divine feminine, you're scared. You're scared. But this is letting you know that all those ventures will be successful and there will be happy times. So no need to worry. No need to worry. Oh, let me read. The snake. Enemy. 
enemies, your thoughts, again, the way you communicate with yourself, what you're telling yourself is what's holding you back. That's what's holding you back. That's what's negative around you right now. Your thoughts. Just like a divine feminine. Your thoughts. So I guess you're mirroring each other. Because look at this. You're happy within. You're contented. The shepherd. This is an in indication of an intense love of life. So you're loving yourself, you're loving life. But you want to make that important move, that important step that will change your life. And you're scared. See that? This is my full card. Take that leap of faith. Take that leap of faith. You're being told to take the leap of faith. This is a recovery, the mouse, after your loss. So again, successful ventures. You're regaining that which you lost before. You lost your house before. You're moving to a better one. You lost money. Abundance is coming in. You lost your divine feminine. You're getting her back. Or him back. Something that was taken from you. Anything that you have lost. Financially. Even, even yourself. You're regaining strength, you're regaining who you are, seeing who you truly are. And you're regaining that strength. You see that, the bear? You're regaining that strength. Success again, success again. Everything's going to be successful. Just trust in God and move forward. Trust in God and move forward. See the confusion. And keep in mind that there are still people who are against you, who don't want to see you succeed. Because with all these good fortunes around me, trust me, they feel the energy, they know the energy, they know that you are meant for greatness. And they're still going to try and stop you. But there's a message that's going to come in. Divine Masculines, you're going to probably receive a message from your Divine Feminine. When you receive that message, that's your indication that those challenges will be overcome because they're ready to welcome you. They're looking forward to hearing from you. So if you think or you're thinking of communicating with your Divine Feminine but you're not sure whether they will accept your communication, what they will say, what will happen if you contact them, this is it. That message that you're going to get from them is an indication that they're willing to listen. So stop keeping yourself trapped. Stop keeping yourself in that negative energy. Just like the Divine Feminine. You guys are mirroring each other. The Rod. Quarrels. Disagreements. Again, your family members, 
people around you, people close to you, who don't want to see you succeed, who don't want to see you move to something better. They're going to have their say. They're going to have their thoughts on your life. But here's the pig. It is great fortune when you get this pig. And abundance. Trust yourself, trust God. Pray. The tower. Happiness. Happiness. So you're going to get out of this energy. This tower is going to break everything up. That's why you should trust God. He's going to work everything out. That's why we have our successful venture here. Because this tower is going to end things. The tower ended it. And the successful venture started it. You may be a bit sensitive right now because you're anxious. But again, trust in God. You and your divine feminine are meant to be together. Again, you are one. You can feel the happiness you bring to each other. There are plans being made in regards to a family. You want to marry this person. You're very attracted to this person. You want to make this person yours. But you have all these negativity that's surrounding you. But everything is going to work out. The lightning is a surprise. One, two, three, four. Get ready for that surprise. Victory. Victory is on the way. See, some of you may have lost your property. But sometimes when you lose something, when something was taken from you, Sometimes it's for the better. Sometimes it's for the better. So those people who took from you, it's like they were doing you a favor. Who stole from you, it's like they were doing you a favor. Because that allowed your eyes to open so you can clearly see who these people are and what, what they meant to you. Which, in their eyes, you were just like a, somebody to just provide. Comfort. But things are changing. Let's see what's going on with your energy here. What's going on with these masculines? Energy, please. Yep. Had these very same cards for the feminine too. I told you, you guys are aligning. You guys are becoming one. Your patience is paying off. Those plans that you are making for the future. It's paying off. She's thinking about you. You're thinking about her. Those same thoughts that you guys are having. That are holding you back. The same things that... Are holding them back. See this? This is beautiful, is it not? See, you guys are truly aligning. It's the same cards coming out. Second chakra. 
feeling the love and the passion from this person that's driving you to move forward. Because all on that's on your mind and on your heart is the love you want to move forward and this love will conquer everything. <laughs> that broken heart. Conquer everything. That love will heal that broken heart. It's time for the broken hearted season to be over. Wow. I guess that's confirming it. <laughs> that broken hearted season is over. It's time for abundance. Because you'll bring abundance to each other's lives. There you go. Carnocopia. Success in all ventures. And that communication. That communication is going to work out just fine. So if you're thinking of communicating with your divine feminine, there, second chakra showed up again. Because you're in the same energy. You're aligning. It's time for union. <laughs> thinking man. Yes. Awesome. Now let's see what what's on your mind. What's your energy right now as you're watching this? Oh, yes. Ten of waters, that's the ten of cups, baby. Oh my gosh, look. I tell you, check out the Divine Feminine's reading on my, my regular channel, Twindy. You'll see how aligning these two messages are. Messages are. Ten of cups, ten of pentacles. That happy family, happy life, happy home. That's what's on your mind right now. That's what you want to build. And it's the same thing that was on their mind and what they wanted to build. You guys are becoming one. <laughs> Page of air. Page of swords. Being curious. Now you want to give back. Now you want things to be equal. Now you want to share. You have the page of cups and the page of air. You want to make that offer. So you're the one bringing in that surprise to them because this page of, of cups is a surprise. Can also be an apology. That's it, Divine Masculines. Align things. You gotta make that move. You gotta take that leap of faith. See? You gotta make that move. You gotta take that leap of faith. Develop that strength and move forward. You won't know what will happen if you do not move forward. If you do not attempt, make that attempt, you won't know what will happen. You sitting there in your head, in your thoughts, it's not gonna help. It's not gonna help. Hold on to your abundance. Feel secure within yourself. Feel that balance. Feel how free you are. That's because things are aligned. Things are aligned so you can feel that freedom. Your plans are working out just fine. Six, four, three of pentacles. Wanting to work together. Wanting to build together with the divine feminine. Your plans are working out just fine. See that? Completion, the world. And that message that you want to send, that phone call that you want to make, it's going to turn out just fine also. See that? Celebration. Celebration. Because your hearts are aligned. Celebration. Your hearts are one. Union. That's the most beautiful feeling you've ever felt. It's a feeling of union. That's why you feel so calm. That's why you feel so free. <laughs> because you know that you belong together. 
your lovers? And there she is, surrounded by your strength. Surrounded by your strength. Feeling calm, feeling protected because she can feel you. She can feel your love. She can feel your protection and your strength. Let's get a message here for from the Archangels. Let's see what they have to say to you in regards to this message. Relationship harmony. What did I say to you? Archangel Raguel, we angels are opening the hearts of everyone involved. Arguments and conflicts are being resolved now so you can get out of your head. Stop thinking that things are going to be like it was in the past. It will not. Things are changing. That's why you feel so free. Comfort Archangel Azriel. I am with you in your time of need, helping your heart to heal. And here you have, spread your wings. It's time to soar. Do not hold back right now. The timing is perfect and you are ready to soar. There's your answer. There's your answer. The timing is perfect and you are ready to soar divine masculines because everything is aligned right now. It's just you to make that move, take that leap of faith 